Successful businesses are normally those businesses that address social problems or societal problems. Now, this entrepreneur invented his innovation around the problem of garbage. And this is his story. Poor sanitation is a major development obstacle in most developing countries like Uganda. However, prioritization and investments in solid waste management by individuals and governments in most developing countries is limited, creating an imbalance between the population's needs and the available services. Technology has emerged as a solution to this problem, and Bagai Richard, a postgraduate computer engineer, has invented a smart garbage bin system. He explains material components comprised of this system. We use the simple technology of using the simple components that can be found around town. That, that is the Adreno bots and uh, some sensors. For example, in our project, we use the ultrasonic sensor. We use the ultrasonic sensor. This sensor measures distance of objects. It measures distance of objects. For example, in our, in our project, the objects we are having is the garbage. So this sensor is going to be measuring the, the distance of the garbage. How does this smart garbage system work? So whenever you put garbage inside, it will measure that distance closer to that sensor. So when the garbage reaches the sensor, it will show you that it's at 100%. Then we using that other microcontroller is connected to the GSM module. That GSM module sends messages on phone, emails. So once it detects that the garbage is at a high level, it will send a message on the phone. In our, in our programming, we include uh, the phones, the numbers we want the messages to go to. For example, if it's KCCA and it's another contractor con uh, collecting the garbage, so the, the, the SMSs will go to the contractor, for example, the Nabugabo that collects rubbish, and they will also go to the supervisor, which is KCCA. So without sending the person to go and check whether the bin is full, so with just a mere notification of a message, they can receive that message, then they can come and collect that garbage. Apart from promoting sanitation, it also has other benefits. So it, uh, it saves time, resources for checking on the garbage, whether the bins are full of garbage. So we remove that, we see that we are remotely monitoring the garbages around the city. Embracing this system in the city and Uganda at large will help a great deal in the promotion of sanitation. Okay, uh, for a moment it's just a prototype, but we are hoping if we get funds, we can, uh, we can, we can employ it around the city. For example, I'll give you an example of uh, Nakasero Market. When you pass there in the evening or early in the morning, the, 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 the garbage bins are, are full to the extent that the, gar the, the garbage is covering the bins. When you move around down area, okay, with the upper, upper bit of Kampala, it's okay, but down, down city there is too much. Ga the, those garbage bins, they are, full of, they are full of garbage. So with this system, hmm, whereby you can send notifications to both the contractor and the supervisor, they can act in time. For example, we can set that collect this garbage when it's at 50%. So meaning that by the time they reach there, it will be like at uh, 80%. Eh? Then they can do what? They can uh, empty the bins. In, in, as a result, we shall keep our city clean.